Well, Kenny, you can't underestimate the form that Sunderland are in, but nevertheless, another disappointing defeat. It is, yeah, and we are disappointed with it. You know, the key moments in both boxes we didn't get right tonight. Uh, the first one is, you know, blocked by O'Neill, and then a, a header for White. We've got experienced players on those guys, and you know, still managed to get what is a, you know, a key goal. And obviously, the second one. And for the most part, we transferred it well around, around the back and got the ball out to Daniels, who delivered very well. But, you know, on that occasion, we've got caught. And um, in both boxes tonight, you know, we just didn't get it right. We had a lot of good crosses into the box. And, you know, from not just open play, but from set pieces, from wide free kicks. And, and you know, we didn't get on the end of them or, you know, make something uh, for somebody else in terms of a knockdown or a shield. Or, or, or rolling a player and being able to, you know, then go outside them and deliver. And as you say, there were crosses into the box, but people will see zero shots on target as a damning indictment, especially here at home. Yeah, definitely. You know, we do want to uh, uh, do more than that. Uh, and as I said, you know, we get a lot of balls in. We generally do, you know, in our play, get there and we have to, you know, one way or another, all the way through the side, make sure we get on the end of those. You made, I think, five changes going into the game. Just talk us through those ones. Yeah, obviously, James Bolton, 100% fit now is is a good one for us. You know, having then natural fullbacks uh, uh, can can help us, and and you know some some combinations, you know, with with Harrison and to Marcus, are experienced players. Obviously, then Ryan Williams, I thought had a good game and coming in on the right hand side, it's very competitive between himself, him and uh, and Marcus Harness. Uh, but both are good players. But I did feel that uh, Ryan played well tonight. Um, Andy Cannon limped off in the second half. What's the prognosis on him? Yeah, he felt his hamstring. I don't know how bad it is, but um, you know he's been sort of full out and flat out, you know, in terms of this season. And uh, we'll certainly assess it in the next 48 hours. I'm sure we'll talk about it later in the week. But the Wembley final on Saturday is that a distraction that you need now from this bad run of form in the league? Well, we you know, want to put things right and get back to winning ways and hopefully it can give us some confidence and, and you know if we do get our details right I think we've got the players to turn it round but similarly you know we're the ones that got to do it and, and you know whether that's as you say at Wembley on Saturday whether that can help us going forward or not we you know we we take it head on and we work at what we're not doing uh, very well and, and we do work work hard to put it right many thanks Kenny cheers